The Dangote Cement Factory, Ibeche, is described as one of the best technologies in the world. Built with two lines to provide initial 6 million tons of cement in a year and increase to 12 million tons with additional two lines in no distant future, the cement compares with the best in the world too. From the mining of limestone with the latest equipment known as surface miners to a two kilometers long conveyor belt down to the kiln and bagging, it presents a marvelous environment friendly system. This is the spectacle that excited top government functionaries, business tycoons, and elder statesmen to take a journey to Ibeche, even as the community was in its best of mood. This is a, it's so marvelous. Today is a very wonderful Thursday for good people of uh, Ishokan, and you are not local government, and the entire Ogun state people. The wait for Mr. President Dr. Goodluck Jonathan was worth the while as he eventually did the commissioning, which he described as a turning point in manufacturing in Nigeria. When I honored him by giving him the GCON, a number of people raised issues out of ignorance. People even said, Oh, I gave the title reserved for vice president to a person who is not holding a political office. People didn't even know that people that not I cannot say in terms of importance to this country, you cannot say that fifty percent of Dangote have the GCON. The factory is to provide employment for an initial seven thousand five hundred Nigerians and this will no doubt impact much more positively on its immediate environment. Apart from that, to empower the youth, we give them uh, cement on credit just to the community as a basic policy we don't do credit supply but to the immediate community we fix up a small quantity where they can take credit supply of cement and sell beyond job creation however is the benefits of nigeria one of the biggest importers of cement becoming an exporter of the product with the accompanying foreign exchange earnings that will strengthen the naira you need people who have confidence in the economy, who have resources to invest, not in buying and selling, but in production. Alaji Aliko Dangote is an example for all Nigerians and all Africans, and especially our government officials. The 95-year-old monarch, Oba Joel Bangboshe, invited the president, Dangote Group, Alaji Aliko Dangote, to Ibeshi after 30 years of searching for investors to come and tap the limestone belt in the area, which stretches even up to Republic du Bene. No foreigner will come and build our country. We have to start. When they are convinced things are happening, then they will come over. And that's really what we are doing. The whole of Korea, there are only five companies that build Korea. And uh, look at what Korea is today. So we are not going to wait for foreigners to come and build our economy. We will build our economy and they will join us later to expand it. There were praises for Chief Olushe Gwanshoba, former governor of Ogun State, and former president of Nigeria, Chief Olushe Obasojo, for their roles in facilitating the giant project, just as the incumbent governor, Senator Ibikule Amosu, expressed gratitude to Dangote Group for investing in the state. Dangote Cement Ibeche is self-sufficient in electricity with three turbines that generate a total of 112 megawatts of electricity which can serve the entire state.